Our missionary journey today brings us to the place called Salem uh, Methodist Church here in the middle of Cheslin Hay. And we're going to worship, we're going to pray, and we're going to sing. And we're going to give thanks for the church here in Cheslin Hay at Salem Methodist Church and for the community uh, in this area. So we're, we're going to sing our first song today, which is Holy, 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 Lord God Almighty. Father, we thank you for this place called Salem Methodist Church. We thank you for this community here of Cheslin Hay. And as we sing that song, Holy, 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 Lord God Almighty, we thank you for your presence here in this place, for your presence in the people here of Salem Methodist Church. And we pray at this time for all that is going on in terms of them thinking about returning to worshipping as they would have done in this building that we're standing next to today. But we pray for the people, Lord. We pray for the gathered community of Cheslin Hay, and particularly these people here at Salem Methodist Church. And Lord, we pray for all the work that's going on in the building called Salem Methodist Church. We pray for all the work that's going on there, Lord, all the remedial work and things to make the building safe and secure things to make the building viable for the future and Lord you know the future of this place you know the future of this church and you know the future of the people here Lord and we pray that those people who are involved in this church will sense your guidance your leading your showing them what is the next step for the people here what is the next step for the people here Lord, we pray for the town here. We pray for this small place called Cheslin Hay. We pray for everyone here, Lord, that this church will be a beacon of light in this town, in this village. Be with the people here, Lord, as they move forward. In Jesus' name. Amen. And a reading all about love. But I tell you who hear me, love your enemies, do good to those who hurt you, bless those who curse you and pray for those who ill-treat you. If someone strikes you on one cheek, 
turn the other also. If someone takes your cloak, do not withhold your tunic. Give to everyone who asks of you. And if anyone takes what belongs to you, do not demand it back. Do to others as you would have them do to you. Lord, as we think of those words, we think of the willing and giving hearts of the people of this fellowship here. Lord, we pray that they will be able to continue to open their doors, to reach out to the community, to help those in need, to give them not just the tunic, but the cloak as well. Lord, we pray for all that's gone on here before the doors were having to be closed for the pandemic. And we pray for all that is yet to come. Loving Lord Jesus, guide and protect all those who are involved here. Show them the way forward. Touch their hearts and fill them with your many blessings. Fill them with your light, the light of your love that can shine so deep within that it reaches out to the furthest corners, touching the hearts of all those who engage with this building. Lord, send your Holy Spirit to shake off the dust from the weeks that the doors have been closed, to bring renewal and the resurgence of your love within this place. In the name of Jesus, Amen. Amen. So we're going to sing that song, Blessed Be Your Name. Bless this church and all who worship here. 
Bring your blessing and pour them out upon Cheslin Hay and all who live here and pass through the streets. In the name of Jesus, bring your blessings. Amen. Amen.